Hello, this is Crafty Crafty, and today we are playing another episode of Great Tech New Horizons Season 2. Last episode, we were stuck with our Botania journey. Uh, by the way, I also made uh, three more the Pure Daisies, and today we found the miss one of the missing one things, flowers. And I found it with Nature Compass, which is actually quite easy to make. Refined glue is centrifuging slime or sticky resin, which I did. I did. I did. Anyway. <laughs> and this. Nature's compass allows you, me to find... Well, uh, different biomes, and I found a biome that contains this flower. And with that, let's look at the day blue. Two yellow, one orange, one light blue. Cyan. Ah, light blue. Orange. Yes. I, can, I think I... I can make three, but I... I... Because let's look at it. Actually, it's Botania. Age of, uh, end of lane. Okay, you don't require any. That's good. That's good. And the nightshade. Nightshade is also doesn't require. So good. We are good. And I need seeds. I'm seeding with seeds. Actually, let's take those. And buckets come here. Okay. Uh, it's already. Yes, we made our first day blue. Second. Third. And we will get a fourth one. From this. So yeah, we have four day blue. Now, what we're gonna do is take this. And take this. Mana spreader. Um, air. And you will... Yes. Shoot to this guy. And... Day blooms. I will just... Place two at now. Okay. This is connected to this, and... I hope we are getting some mana. I hope. Eventually. Uh, by the way, why I'm just placing two? Because if I remember correctly, they will decay. They will decay and uh, they will turn. They will die eventually. Uh, yeah. Only an hour. Daybloom is extreme super generation flower that all we have to do is place it down and it will produce mana for free during the day. Uh, okay. And dump powder, redstone or glowstone. Or sugar. Homium dust. Okay, any dust. <laughs> <laughs> A lot of dusts. Okay, we are getting mana. We are getting some mana. I will use... You know what? Gunpowder. Or... Or should be enough. Uh, it's probably not going to be... Yeah. Yet. So we are, we are gonna wait. But while waiting, we also... Need to do... 
few more things. Also, I really need a way to get more flowers because spending time in Twilight Forest is fun, but it's also really time consuming and I need time. Not the spice one, the universal constant one. Actually, it's not constant, it's so st it's relative, but anyway, who cares? I do. Anyway, let's look at our new project. First, we are gonna need some steel plates. And also, I did some rearranging around here. Electrolyzer, cutting machine. I, uh, yeah, that that's mostly it. So be right back when everything is ready. Okay, we got our all we need, and I will take it back. And beans on toast, and energy drink, which is, by the way. I really have a re I have a really strong stand against energy drinks. Most of them is uh the most one of the most harmful things you can put on your body. But I will eat in the game. Cause it's extra hard, unlike the real world. Actually, I wasted, but anyway, I don't need much speed because I have speed. Speed. Okay. It's uh, now our new, uh, our first automation is going to be really fun. Let's take this guy and do I have any tin pipe? Item pipe. Oh, I can use brass item pipe too, actually. Do I have any brass? Yes, I actually... Okay, let's think first. What we're gonna need is first... Centrifuge. This will be the... Starting point. I will feed it on this, this side and... It will give us... Two outputs. One, actually three out. One is. I can just do this. Not this way. Okay. I can do it. Yes, I did it. Okay. First part is going to be the output, uh, input. Second top is going to be the item output, and side is going to be the fluid output. Yeah. And for item output, we actually can use our old friend. I'm gonna need more rubber. Okay, and I think I need to cancel you guys for now and let's make one last batch or wait old method yeah because we're gonna need a lot of uh rubber okay and let's come here and yeah also, the brass is ready, yes. And let's look at the... This guy. Is it ready? Yeah! Two. Okay, I got two. And I just... No, I don't want to risk it. Okay. We got two mana powder. We have two remaining. Okay. This is going to be the fluid output, and then... 
Actually, no. I don't need to. Let's let me look at the steps again. Chemical reactor. Okay, uh, not the fluid one. Okay, fluid is going to be just stored. So item is need to go this way. So yeah, I should know. Uh, yeah, yeah. I just need the tank. Temperature centrifuge. Yes, I just need a tank. And after that. That it will give me a fluid, molten rubber, which I'm going to store as fluid too. So I will need two tanks. And actually, let's think of it. Let's do this. Well, you will still be the input. But on top, the fluid output, why I'm using the built-in output as fluid output? Because conveyor belts are cheaper. And to item input. And we will just use our small brass pipes. Okay. And do I have any wires with me? Yes, I have. Thank you. And I just gonna need two more. Thank you. Okay. With that, let's do this and this. And small brass pipes. I think it should be like is and i can't believe how long this wrench lasted me i i still can't believe anyway <laughs> let's continue with our project by the way i am uh explaining the first automation but the later ones are just going to be i use this this and this is the result and this one is not does not have that kind of thing. Okay. Basic chemical reactor. And you will also need sulfur as input, which I'm going to provide in here. And I need one more. Uh actually no. And just you operate it. Now come here is easier and looks cooler. But hopper is cheaper. So hopper. Hopper. Come here. Go. And also your output is going to be. Let's take you here. Right here. And your output is going to be here. Actually, your you will give me let me look only fluid right yes only fluid output so i don't i don't have to care about the in item input and let's take your back you will give me not this really Java barrels, uh, Java. Allows barrel to automatically output. Barrel upgrade. Actually, you will be much better. Time to think of it. I will make a barrel upgrade for you. Okay. And then this with this and. Import. Yes. And this side is export. Okay. This part is automated. I just need... Also, uh, yeah, one... 
I just need to make two barrel tingy majiggies and I need to make day because my day blooms are wasting their time. Okay, I just need to make two hopper upgrades and also let's try this. One more. Just one more. Okay, I just need a this and also fl uh, fluid solidifier i want to use fluid solidifier vitae buffer come to think of it can i make it yeah i can make it a bit more compact if i do this do this do this Oh, I can't. Actually, I can. Oh. Yeah. Being compact is not uh, a luxury in this state. We will make much more compact uh, builds in the future. Today is not the day. Okay. Fluid Saltifier. Actually, can I, I mean, yeah, this, okay. you will just fluid auto output and you will also fluid auto output item will be trained from here and let's get these guys. You will be here. You will be here. Sulfur is going to be here. Wait, wait a second, I can make it compactor. Uh, just a bit. Because... Uh, you know what? Those pipes are also inventories. And... Actually, yeah, yeah, let me just craft the necessary upgrades and then we will finish the build. Okay, we are back with our upgrades, but also one last thing. Yes, we finished this part. Yeah, it gives a glowstone. But with that, we can finally make end of play. Uh, which will be we will do uh, at the end of the episode, but currently we are going to finish this guy. Okay, first I think I can I no I can't. I think I need to first apply this and then this. Bye. Oh. Okay. Uh, I think I need a barrel hammer for that. But it's outputs. Okay. Now, also, let's try to do this directly. No. This one upgrade. Okay. Now, this is where we're going to put our... Some of our stickers. And after that, we're going to... We are not doing anything because we don't have any power. Actually, come to think of it. Yeah. We don't have any power, but we can provide a cheat way. I will just steal this for now, but we will, we will put it back. If I do this, uh, I need wire cutter, which should be here. Cutter, wire cutter, thank you. And mm, actually, let's make it more uh, looking nice. 
and this. This. And if I do these two minimize the wait wait a second. Mm, let's do this to minimize the total travel distance because you you know you know this is not lossless so we just need to provide steam from here to here from here to here so we will just use our pot in pipes Apparently, this guy doesn't like being uh, um, uh, it's down, so I will try this approach. Uh, let me just break you. And put you here. Wait. Connection to here and structural upgrade. Upper upgrade and this. It still doesn't put it here. Why? And if I try this, oh, why you are not pushing? Just item pipe, okay. Connected. Why you are not pushing? You're also not pushing. Okay, this is a waste of time. We should use our old friend. Okay, this part is ready, and now what we need sulfur. Okay, did I make any sulfur? Sulfur. Do I have any sulfur? I guess not. We need to process you guys. And we need to make it day. Also, we need to make our tanks. So we are currently making that. But the main part is working. And the refined glue is tank. I will put the tank here. And it periodically takes everything. Okay. Four or five. And it will have four or five. And now it it periodically pushes at its uh, enough speed and it's passive, so it's not a problem. Four or five. Okay, it pushed. 411. Okay. Now, what we're gonna need is sulfur. Rush sulfur. Or chamber. You will be the faster one. Okay. And if I try to make mana steel, let me just look at the mana steel recipe. Yeah, stealing it and image it. Yes, we get our first mana steal, and we will continue with our sulfur journey. It's almost ready, and we have water. Good, good, good. By the way, if I centrifuge you for us. Okay, it just extra sulfur, but it doesn't uh, justify the extra weight at the time. So we will just wash it. And with that, and up with our tanks, uh, it's there waiting for those guys. Okay, sulfur. And wait a second. If I put you. Stop. Okay. Over nine to one and see. Thirty seconds. Okay. So 
Let's put this and it's going to transfer, transfer. Or is it going to stuck? It might stuck. Yeah, I might try to. Uh, I might try something else with this. Okay, this sh setup should work. I just need to put this and this import, import and work. Okay, yes. So come here, import. Conveyor import and yes, it's working. And we're gonna just need our two tanks. You not fully ready, but at least for one, it should be okay. Two, three, four, five, six. Okay, hammer time and huge. Wait, pipe. Thank you. Thank you, my friend. And low voltage fluid pipe uh, tank. And you're gonna need bronze plate. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Do I have any bronze plate? No, I don't. No problem. Making bronze plate is easy. And yeah, with that, we are making rubber and glue. So yeah, we will, we won't be a, have, uh, having much problem with sticky stuff. And let's just take this and if I, eh, nah, not yet. We're just gonna need 16. Uh, more of this and are you ready now just two more okay plates should be ready and low voltage fluid tank uh, steel plate thank you low voltage Oh, also iron plate. Ah. Me and the plates. Ah, actually, I have iron plate. Anyway, extra plate doesn't hurt. I need copper plate. Not bronze plate. I need to look at what I'm uh, trying to get. Uh, trying to do. Okay then, we will be ready when everything is... Uh, we will be back when everything is ready. Okay, we made our uh, first low voltage fluid tanks and we get a quest for them. Thank you. And they gave us large fluid pipes. And that works. And let's put you guys here. Okay. Low voltage fluid tank. You. And you. Then we are gonna need one more fluid pipe. Uh, bronze fluid pipe should be okay. Small bronze fluid pipe should be uh, really okay because it's not going to be much of a heavy bandwidth. So, uh, fluid auto output. Okay, it starts out out of. Outputting. Do you have any output site? No, we need to add a pump to this guy. Luckily, we have a lot. And yeah, it's outputting. And if I want, let's say, plates, rubber, uh, I just need to do this, <laughs> and we have all the plates we can, we need. 
And also this. We have glue. Actually, should I... Yeah, I have uh, lots more refined glue here. And let's empty this. And I need also... I need to quite, uh, do this, so let me just... This while we are making our... Exactly. And do you have it? Yes, enough mana for now. Okay, Exoflame. Exoflame, what you are required? Two red. Ah, sorry. Endoflame. The wrong one. Uh, brown, red, gray. Uh, light gray. Right? Yeah, light gray. Red. And two brown. And burning blossom. I don't have one. Burning blossom. I literally have only one. Uh, and end of flame. And one mono powder. Okay. And. Uh, it, we should have seeds here. Okay. No water. Water. One. And monopod. Voila! We have an end of flame. Get the quest. Ah, it requires two. Okay. Uh, no problem, because it should be enough for now. And how it works? Let's put... Ling it. Lignite. Ling it, lignite. I don't know how to pronounce it. Yeah. It's producing mana by burning things. So yeah. This is how it's going to be, be work. Uh, go. I will have to make 16 mana steel. Uh, but it's going well. In the meantime, we had our first automation. We are producing rubber and glue. We find glue and molten rubber. So yeah, we are completely fine. <laughs> and we are we're going to swim in rubber. That sounds wrong. Anyway, this is Trafte and have an amazing day.